Hello everyone, back at you with another video. It's been a little while since I've made a video. So I have a happy new year to all of you. Uh, it's been a little while. And so I have finally bought some uh, some silver coins. And uh, originally, let's open this package up. Originally, when I started stacking silver back in 2013, I had set a goal of 1,500 ounces, and I reached that goal, um, oh, about a year ago, and so, oh man, what is this type of material, let's see here, let's do this a different way, I don't want to make a mess here, I feel like this thing out of here. Ah, never use those envelopes. All right, so as I was saying, uh, where was I? 1,500 ounces, I achieved that. So now I'm, o I'm only buying what I like to collect. I actually, when silver was at, at $27, almost $28, a few months back, I sold um, 300 ounces to pay off my Chevy Chevelle. And so that was a hot rod I bought this summer. And here is this uh, Neo, I'm not sure about this, but uh, this coin, but I really liked it. I, saw, I got this on eBay. I used my e-bucks and this lion is pretty cool. So we're, now I'm just buying things that I like. The premiums are too high. There's, so the sales tax in my state is almost 10%. And so I, 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 I ain't buying much. Uh, mostly a stacker that uh, stacked weight. So 10 ounce bars, one ounce rounds, and then the occasional collection that I liked. So uh, I did find something after this new year. So this will be added to the collection. It's in a flip. I'm gonna put it in the capsule. I really like it. And these are one of my favorite bullion coins. And at the time, silver was at uh, 16, spot price was at 16.55. I got these in 2015. This is the 2015 uh, Kookaburra uh, anniversary. I think it's an anniversary, yeah. 20. So anyway, I bought 10 of them and I had never unboxed them. This is the Goat Privy. I had never unboxed them, so they're still in their original plastic uh, plastic bags. So there was a nice find. I was cleaning out a drawer and I saw the box and I didn't think there was anything in it. I must have put it away after receiving it. So we have, like I said, 10 of them. I'm gonna take them out of the bags and put them in this tube and hold on to them they do carry a nice premium i see them on ebay for 47 to 42 dollars a piece and they've done well i paid for them uh, back in 2015 when spot 16.55 an ounce i think it was 24.35 i'll put a picture of it here uh, so very nice uh, premium and they they're doing well but now with the premiums. And another thing I got from Atmex is this original uncirculated Roosevelt Dimes from 1954. This is the original in the, in the original bankroll. I think they're pretty rare to find an untouched roll of 90% rosy. So this was all part of the same, um, I don't know if it was part of the same order, but it was around the same time. So I think I paid $74 for this roll. 
Other than that, I've just been working and taking care of things here around the house. I do have some travel plans that have been put on hold. Uh, hopefully this year in my area right now, things are pretty bad. So um, I'm gonna hold off on, on doing anything until things get under control. I hope everyone is doing well wherever you are. And uh, hopefully things start getting back to normal and everyone can get back to what we call normal life. I'm keeping it pretty, uh, I keep a positive attitude and go forward. So it is what it is. And uh, I miss making videos. I just haven't had anything to, uh, to upload. Haven't been traveling, haven't been uh, doing much of anything other than working and staying home. So leave me a comment. Let me know what you think of these finds. And uh, I have another a couple pieces that I got my eye on. Just unique stuff that I'm going to be collecting. So... If you haven't subscribed already, I'd appreciate it and hit the like button and we'll see you on the next video.